Hi folks, so today is a special day because it's been one week since I've brought the baby squirrels into our lives. Um, what I want to do is weigh them and see how much weight they've gained in the last couple days. The last time I weighed them, they were about 125 grams. Um, that was the big one and the little one was probably 108. So they've been getting fed about four times a day, um, half their body weight in puppy milk. So they should have put on quite a good amount of weight in the last few days. So I'm going to show you. Um, this is the little cage we have them sleeping in. It kind of isn't the best, but I'm going to be upgrading. So let's grab... Can you guys see them? They they snuggle. See how they they snuggle together? Oh, so cute. So let me grab one. Okay. Uh, there we go. I think I got the little one. So come on. Does not want to let go. Come on. There we go. Look how their feet catch on to everything. Here we go. He's looking for his sibling. So what I use is just a little food scale that I actually never use for food purposes. So this is probably a great reason to own one. So I'm just going to put, this is Gizmo, I think, Gizmo on here. 126, 125, 124. So that is a spectacular amount of weight for this little guy to have gained in just a couple days. So let's see the sibling. Okay, you know what? Is this the bigger one? I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, that is the bigger one. Bigger one is 140. So Blinky has gained 15, just over 15 grams in a few days. How's that, Blinky? Hmm? What do you think? You're doing so well. Both of you are. Yeah. Okay, so I'll put him back. So now that they're awake, they know that means that it's time to eat. So what I've done is I've warmed up their formula. Just for like 10 seconds, not very long. And I just use a little syringe that I actually, I have a bunch of them because my dog is currently on a liquid diuretic for congestive heart failure so I'll just fill this up now I don't have my daughter filming me today so this isn't the easiest thing to do okay let's see if I can feed them this way today oh yeah so here we go I take my time with it. It's kind of funny when they're both in here and I feed them this way, they can get a little bit aggressive with each other. So if that starts happening, I'll usually take them out. I don't want someone to get a injury or something, but they're leaving each other alone. Here. There we go. Oh, are you coming right out? Okay. Now, this isn't the best position to feed a squirrel from, but they're getting more agile and stronger, so 
he doesn't seem to mind and he's eating. So we'll get this one down in him and see if he goes back in his nest for his next feeding. Okay. I know. I know. There you go. Oh, but... there you go. Almost lost you. Hey, get back in there. Well, I'm going to put the phone down and I'm going to properly feed them now. So I'll keep you updated. Bye.